What's up, people? Today, I am coming to you really quick because I was asked a question about the federal court removal, and I stated that all cases can be removed to federal court. Now, here's why I said that. The Supreme Court addressed the question of what will be the requirement of a federal court removal in Dart Cherokee Basin Operating Company versus Owens. And basically, no evidence is required to remove a case from any court to federal court. The removal statute, 28 U.S.C. 1446, a short and plain statement of the grounds for the removal is all that is required to remove a case to federal court. Rule 8A of the Federal Rules of Civil Procedure, a removal notice need consist only of a pleading and not evidence. Now, at some point, the removing party may ultimately be called to prove contested jurisdictional facts with evidence. Now, this is also what I mean by you have to give the federal court jurisdiction over the matter. And the easy is most cases that are removed from places like traffic court, state court, um, superior court. They can be removed on the grounds of civil rights. And I've given you that um, statute. But that is the one thing that I wanted to bring to everyone's attention today because all cases can be removed to federal court because of the federal rules of civil procedure 8a and 28 usc 1446 so keep that in mind you will have to present evidence at some point because once you have submitted evidence the case must be heard but you do not need evidence just for the removal so keep that in mind see you next time